Connor's afternoon off. Choo choo's a Connor. Choo choo's a pussy. The entrance are so dull are very friendly. And none more friend than Connor. Hong Kong to Mavis. Connor's a very happily rocket engine. He has lots of friends. Hong Kong to Mavis. There's Mavis at the quarry. Hong Kong Salty at the docks. Choo choo's a Connor. And Thomas, the all Connor's friends. One day, Connor had finished all her jobs. Then she came back to the mission. He has spent the afternoon at the farm. Connor was visiting the animals. As he was about to read, the fat controller arrived. Connor, he said, I have three important specials. As you can finish early, you will have time to do all of them. Yes, sir, Puff Connor. But Connor was worried. He liked being useful, but three jobs was taking him the rest of the day. And now he has no time to go to the farm. Connor puffed off. He felt sad. But then Connor had an idea. Perhaps he could everything get done in time. All I need some help. Was just one of my jobs. I asked one of my friends. Connor's first job was to shunt some trucks in the yard. Connor's first job was to some trucks in the yard. As he arrived, he As saw arrived, he saw Mavis. Mavis will help me. Mavis will help me. Sorry, Tana. Toby. Sorry, no Tana. No time to talk to Mavis. And, she steamed and he steamed past and her. Tana was, was upset. He had been sure Mavis she has been sure him. Mavis would help him. Oh, I just have to shunt the trucks on my own. He pups sadly. Next, Connor had to collect some empty depot. trucks from the depot. As you, while well, Thomas was leaving, Thomas called Connor. Wait, can you help me take some trucks? We, sh Connor. Sorry, Connor said Thomas. I'm in a hurry. I help you later. And Thomas raced away with Annie and Quail Belt. Connor was surprised. Mavis and Thomas had both worked jobs very quickly. And now he had to take to the coin trucks himself. He was getting late. Connor was worried that he wouldn't get to the farm in time. And she wouldn't get to see the animals. Norris. Once Connor drove the trucks, he rushed to his last job to bring them dark. But my friend Salty will help him. But as Connor arrived, Salty was rushing towards the army. Salty cried Connor, stop please. I have to help Clanky and World Water Car. Help Connor, but I'm running out of time. Will you help me? Ah, uh, sorry, Connor, says Salty. But I have an important delivery. This piston rod is too important to wait for me. Connor felt miserable. She knew deliveries was important, but she thought helping a friend was important too. Neither Mavis, Thomas, nor Salty had helped the Connor. And I thought they were my friends, Puff Connor, sadly. She would have to move all that cargo on her own. Now she'll never get to the farm. Connor pulled in alongside Clanky. Will you wait for said Clanky? I'm here to pick, up, here to the pick up the cargo, said, Toby, said Connor sadly. The ships have been calling a rough seas, Clanky snapped. The cargo won't be here till morning. Connor was delighted. Now she has time to get to the farm, so she raced off. 
Then Toby saw then Harry in an asylum. Saw Hugh out in a siding. We're going in such a hurry. Wish Hugh out sadly. Connor told her about all about going to the farm. And then about Mavis, Thomas, and Salty. Half our friends help each other. The they Mavis, the Connor, but they were too busy to help me. That's because they've all been helping me. Plus, you all. Kinda was surprised. I broke down, said he well. So Mavis brought my special coal. Thomas took my passengers, and Salty brought me new piston rod. Connor knew that she made a mistake. Mavis, Thomas, and Salty have been helping a friend after all. They were all helping you, gasped Connor. Toby felt Connor silly. felt very silly. Is there anything, there I, anything can I can do to help you? He asked. Hero, he asked. Hero was surprised. Hero was surprised. But then you won't get to the farm to see the animals. Said Hero. It doesn't matter, said Connor. Helping a friend is much more important. What can I do? Hero asked Connor to take the carriages to Nafford Station. Hero's carriages carriages were very I don't bumpy know if I will be able to move them, and heavy. I don't know if I'll be able to move them, said Connor, but I'm going to try. Connor moved, not rolled away. He heaved and heaved and he huffed and pulled. Ow, oh, ass. Hero's carriages began to move. Hero was very pleased. Thank you, Connor. He called us Connor puffed away. Sorry about your afternoon off. But Connor didn't matter. Oh, she's about helping a friend. That's after about afternoon off any day.